105 PSI. This was at 85 yesterday, 88. So this engine is down 30 PSI on one cylinder. I think it might be a stuck O-ring in one of the pistons. I bought this engine for $400. I'm gonna use some deep creep seafoam, non-sponsored. This is just something that a lot of you guys were suggesting in the comments. So I'm gonna let this sit for 24 hours and then I'm gonna come back and check the compression numbers again. No discoloration, they all look pretty much the same. So, spark plugs are new. So there's not re they're not really telling me anything. Brand new pressure gauge that I bought in Advanced Auto Parts. <laughs> Safe to say that's 110. Be 108. A little bit under 90. So I'm going to give it 88. That's what this one's at. It's a little scary. 88. Bam. So what do you guys think about these compression numbers? I'm going to be using this deep creep sea foam. And hopefully it's just some stuck rings. This can didn't come with a little red straw. Wish it did. Hey, one thing, this engine's gonna smoke when I go to start it. So it's been about 15 hours since I put the penetrating oil. I let it sit overnight. I'm gonna crank the engine over. That wasn't smart. Remember, I'm not a professional. Let's start off with the first cylinder that gave us issues. Cross your fingers, let's go. Whoa, look at that. No, oh my God. Am I looking at this correctly? 105 PSI. This was at 85 yesterday, 88. I let this sit for 15 hours. Seafoam, you need to sponsor me. I'm promoting you guys. I'm happy. I'm in a good mood today, guys. I think this one was like at 110 yesterday. <laughs> 120. So what do you guys think about these compression numbers today? Let's compare it to yesterday. I even went to buy some starting fluid, some power tune, some sea foam. So this is the first time I'm gonna start the engine. Premixed oil with sea foam. First, let me, I'm gonna spray some starter fluid, a very little. been about five hours and I'm gonna do a compression check for the last time we're gonna see if the power tune from mercury did any, any good and 
we're going to be ending this science experiment so far deep creep it brought up the compression up to 105 so let's see how it is right now so we're at 100 psi So I guess you can say this science experiment was pretty good. We started off with 88 PSI and we're ending up at 100. So that's the end of this science experiment. Deep creep, seafoam, highly recommend it. I think it saved my engine. Power tuner also did some good work, um, but I feel that deep creep definitely won this one. I'm not a professional, I'm not sponsored by no one. This is just a science experiment that I did for you guys to find entertainment from, and I hope you enjoyed it. So stay tuned for the next one.